Hi guys, my name is AJ from Home Lab Networks, and this is my 2025 Home Lab Network Rack setup and tour. Now, I just wanted to show you guys quickly of what I'm running in my server rack. Nothing much has changed since my last network rack setup video in 2024 or 23, I believe. The only two major things that have changed are the two PC servers I've just built and I've just rearranged my rack a little bit. If you enjoyed this video and it's helped you build your own home lab, please consider leaving a like rating, even subscribing to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Hi guys, welcome to my 2025 home lab network rack setup. I just, just wanted to show you guys what I write in my home lab and how I have set it up. I have a 27U network rack server case, which I bought off eBay for about $600 brand new. Now the recent changes in my home network has been I've just built two PC servers. One is a 2U server case and one is a 3U server case. Now both these servers are identical as far as parts, which with the motherboard I am running a ASUS B550MA Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. The RAM I'm running is a Vergence 32GB, 3200MHz. The CPU is an AMD Ryzen 5500 6-core 12 threads. Now the 2U server has a 500GB Kingston SSD, while the 3U has a 1TB Seagate hard drive. I did buy a gra graphics card for these servers, but unfortunately the graphics card is a, a little bit too big, so I just had to find some old ones laying around that fitted the server case. Down below my two new servers I've built, I've still got my Dell PowerEdge R410, while I've still got my IMB3250. Because of my situation, I only run these servers when I need to, or I want to have my Minecraft server running for my son, but at the moment, my servers only run when I need them to run because I'm at my parents' house and I don't want to use all their power up. Now, nothing much has really changed in my rack since my last setup video, apart from those two brand new servers. So my Dell PowerEdge, I mainly use when I make YouTube videos. My Minecraft server runs on a Linux live server using Crafty Controller. Now for the three-year server, I'm not too sure at the moment what I'm going to do with it, but it's there for the time I decide to do something with it. And it, with my patch panel, I've only got my two, my three servers connected, and that's about it. So I just wanted to give you a quick overlook of my server setup at the moment. I'm pretty happy with the way it looks. Let me know what you guys think. So that's my home lab setup for 2025. I'm sure throughout the year it's gonna change. Things will be taken out, things will be added. Maybe a bigger server rack, I'm not too sure. But I'll leave a link in the des description to all the parts I've used for my builds in my server rack. And I hope um, you guys watching build your own server lab or start to or or have already. Please leave a comment if you want to know anything further about my setup. And I'll do my best to answer everything I possibly can. But I just wanted to give you a quick rundown of what's running in my home lab in 2025. My name is AJ and I'll see you guys in the next video.